Check this out, YouTube. I got four of those burrito shells. I took four of them on a plate, microwaved it for two minutes. And then at 18 seconds left, they were hot and pliable. I f stretched them out four to an entire baking pan like I had been doing. Trying something different with making my burrito action. Now each piece of burrito has a load of that Country Crock original. To stick to each four piece. Lay down a burrito. Slap on that Country Crock original. Lay on the next layer. Etc. Now you have... See that? Different burrito levels. This level going on top of that level. That level going on top of that level. And whenever I go to make a burrito, I'd microwave these in the oven. And uh, they're not as pliable. They get crispy and it just fucks up the burrito. So I thought I'd try something different. I got a plate and four of my burrito shells. And I microwaved them for two minutes. And then with 18 seconds left, I took them out. They're nice and pliable. See, now it folds the burrito like it's supposed to without being like overly crispy on the shells. That's the problem I was having with the burritos. So my shell is ready to be folded into another dank King Cobra burrito. I'm hard boiling some eggs and some water. Because I want to add hard boiled eggs to this burrito with some other delicious, interesting proteins. But I thank you all for watching. And stick around for part two.